So guys, welcome back to another one and yeah, you already read the title, you already seen the thumbnail, so let's get straight into it. And guys, for today's video we have a special character here and that's gonna be Eshitna because honestly like it has been such a long time since we used Eshitna and unironically she is the GOAT nowadays because of course... Uh, the more debuff someone has, the more damage she like actually does, right? And then also with this card, she uh, infects them and they can't really heal anymore. So today I was thinking, you know what, let's combine Eshitna with an unknown team with of course Albedo for the counter, then of course her Queen Hell because she puts on a lot of debuffs and then of course a Nan Nashi in the back because of course he gives those little beautiful little buffs, right? So I know what you guys are saying, 17, the Demon King, Demon King Meliodas is still out there. How are you gonna actually like counter that? But guys, I promise you guys don't even worry about it because I know he cleanses, but he cleanses like one thing, right, from his whole team and then I know when he's unshackled he cleanses like like everything but that's totally fine that's totally fine we have queen hell for the debuffs like i said then we also have eshitna and i promise you guys this team's like actually gonna slap so with that being said guys if you like this sort of content of course consider liking consider subscribing it really helps out the channel and it honestly makes my day and with that being said guys i hope you guys have an awesome rest of your day if you're gonna swim on of course the new demon king meliodas or even the new fairy king harlequin i wish you the best of luck and with that being said guys let's get on to our first match of today here so for our first match, we are up against a unknown team with a Hawk and Oslo and of course a tier there. You know what? I will I will let this in the video because I think it's funny. Uh, okay, so first of all, let's put up a counter. Let's double AOE with our Queen Hell. And I know, guys, the intro was kind of weird, kind of really fast because I have... <laughs> I have a lot of schoolwork still to do, so I'm gonna make this video and afterwards I'm gonna begin with my schoolwork, but yeah, we did a double AoE here and he's still alive, Hakuno Slow, actually the goat here, and like he is still Una wrongly, like he's using this team, well not for any longer because or Albedo is just gonna one shot annihilate him, yeah, 65k damage, you love to see that, and his Hakuno Slow, yeah, he's gone, oh wait, actually survives, Hakuno Slow the goat, wait, what? Um... Yeah, let's do this. <laughs> it, in a rock leader, like, for the first match, it is pretty funny. And look at that massive damage to 323k damage with our Queen Hell. So, of course, with that being said, guys, let's get on to our second match of today with this unknown team. So, for our second match of today, we are up against a demon team. But guys, I know what you guys are gonna say. 17, this is the end of this team. This is the end of this video because you're up against the one, uh, not the one, the, uh, I want to say the one and only Demon King Meliodas and his, um, uh, and his daddy, <laughs> Demon King. <laughs> and of course, his, uh, half-brother, <laughs> Asterosa. But guys, honestly, don't even, don't even worry about it. Um, okay, so he does one AoE, he does the second AoE. We are still fine though, he's not doing a lot of damage there. Um, he is gonna do a lot of damage on our Albedo though. Um, you know what, like Albedo actually like the best tank of this game and she actually like tanks everything. Um, so what we are gonna do is put up a taunt, then single target attack. You know what, actually, uh, yeah, let's single target attack. Or wait, 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 we can do one better. We single target attack and single target attack again, just to be sure, just to be sure. So what I actually wanted to do is like a counter single target attack and then like an AOE with or Eshitna, but honestly, like I don't want to risk it because he has Red Timia link. Yeah, like, like you guys saw, right? He healed a bit. He's gone now. That is actually pretty awesome. And now only his Demon King Melly remains and his Esterosa and a Liz in the back. Okay, a Liz in the back. What I have noticed though is... That a lot of people like actually use like um, not the right units for the backline because they just go for CC, right? I don't know if I'm the only one who has noticed that. But yeah, a lot of uh, a lot of people are like using a lot of CC characters for the back just to get their CC even higher. 145k damage with the counter, damn, that's a lot. That's a lot. Unfortunately, Albedo goes away, but. 145k damage with the counter, that's actually insane. Uh, he goes for Aura uh, Eshitna. Eshitna, uh, she, is a, she is a tank, man. What can I say? Um, okay, he does have the counter there. So what we are going to do is AoE once with Aura Eshitna. Then AoE again. And yeah, we can't really do a single target attack here. <laughs> uh, because we didn't get a single target, target attack from our Queen Hell. But what we can do is like another AoE with our Queen Hell. So, let's see. Okay, we take down the Esterosa there. That's actually pretty huge. 
Then we take him down again. Can we actually go for the melee? Like, he can't heal. Come on, come on, come on. Come on, Queen Hell. I'm trusting my whole faith in you. And look at that. That's actually massive. Okay, now we do also have our Queen Hell ultimate. Um, he has a lot of debuffs. He can't heal because of the corrosion. Um, not the corrosion, I'm sorry. The infect from Aura. Uh, is it not, is, is it not actually like top tier unit? What? And he does a single target attack level 2. Ooh, she is still alive. And you actually love to see it. Her ultimate is gone though, but that's that's fine. That's fine. And look at the corrosion stacks too. Uh, Nanashi. Nanashi, come on, man. My guy. My guy. Wait, does he have a link? No, he does not. Well, he, he kind of does have a link, but we do not care about that link. So we do a single target attack with our Nanashi, and he absolutely annihilates with the 30k damage. So with that being said, guys, let's get on to our third match of today with this unknown team. So for our third match of today, we are up against a another demon team with guys. Honestly, like we, we do not have to worry about no demon team anymore. Demon King Melly, who like he's already outdated like after two weeks. I, I swear. Um <laughs> I'm kidding, guys. I'm still afraid of him. Uh but uh, that aside, um okay, he's gonna single target attack double A we I reckon, right? Right? No, maybe? What's he gonna do? Like, okay, single target attack, AoE. That's fine. If he does not do like a uh, melee AoE, we should be fine. Okay, he does a melee AoE. That's not what I like to see, but you know what? That's that's life. <laughs> what can I say? That's life. Uh, let's put up a taunt AoE actually with our Queen Hell and then single target attack. I know it's like a shit nice video today, but still. Come on, Queen Hell, come on, you gotta do a little bit better than that. A little bit better, a little bit better. Look at that, that's what I'm talking about. My girl, man, my girl. You love to see it. Okay, there goes the Demon King Melly. Still afraid of the normal Demon King, though, but that's one down, that's one Demon King down. <laughs> Nowadays, there are like two in the game, and I don't like it, but hey, it is what it is. Let's see, uh, he does a single target attack with his Asta. Honestly, I think we should be fine because we also have like the Nanashi buffs on our uh, Albedo. Come on, Albedo, come on, you can tank that, you can tank that, look at that. Massive, 90k damage on the, on the counter, okay, okay, that's massive, that's massive. That's gonna hurt, though, that's gonna hurt, right? Oh, Albedo, Albedo gone. That's unfortunate, that's really unfortunate. Then he goes for the Queen Hell, Queen Hell will be alive after this, yeah, she is, okay, that's huge. That's actually huge. So what we are gonna do now, right, we kind of have to take down the Demon King, so we're gonna begin with this AoE, I reckon, then do another AoE with our Ashitna, because they have... A little bit of stacks there. Then a single target attack on the Demon King. And unironically, I think we win after this, right? Okay, there goes the Asta. That's actually pretty huge. Now for the Eshitna. Come on, Eshitna. Come on, take down the Demon King. Nice, 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 nice. You actually love to see it. 104k damage. And there goes the Kusak too. So we won our third match. So with that being said, guys, let's do one more match. And our final match of today. With this, uh, like I said, man. This unknown team with Eshit9 and Queen Hell in it. And ironically, I really like the costume though. So for our fourth and our final match, we are up against another demon team. What a surprise. <laughs> now nah, we are fine, guys. No need to worry. He does have Red Time Link on his DK though. That's something to worry about. Um... And I know, guys, like, I've been rambling this whole video. I'm sorry if that's, like, annoying or anything. Um, but I got a lot of energy today. I don't know what it is. Well, kind of, I know what it is. I'm, I'm like, panicking. Uh, the reason why I'm panicking, like I said, when I have still a lot of schoolwork to do. But honestly, I think we should be fine, right? I think we should be fine. No need to worry, guys. Um, okay, he doesn't AoE. That's fine, though. He does have a lot of corrosion on his melee. So what I'm going to do here is, of course, uh, put up a taunt. AoE and then single target attack. I know this like a shitness video and everything, but like we have to do what we have to do, right? 132k damage, actually not too bad. Then we single target attack the Demon King melee. Actually a lot of damage there, 190k damage. Also guys, I'm always recording on ungeared, so if you think like that's that's not that much like damage wise, it is. We are in ungeared, so that's actually a lot like an arrow here it is. Um, okay, so the positive thing here is well, I see one positive thing, and that's my Albedo has the Nanashi stacks. The not so po well, we do not care. I want to say the not so positive thing is he's gonna double AoE or triple AoE, but he's not gonna do that anymore because he got one kind of like one shotted by our Albedo. You actually love to see it. Let's put up another taunt. Let's um, do an AoE and then a level 2 AoE with our Eshitna. And I think we should be fine, right? Come on, 74k damage, actually pretty huge. 
Then we AoE again with our Ashitna. Come on, Ashitna. Come on, look at that massive damage. Almost 200k. And ironically, if like the Asta did not have the revive there, like he would be gone. He, he would be gone. But now, right, uh, we do have the counter. Kind of afraid though, because we do have a lot of darkness stacks on us. But like still, I think we should be fine. Right? Come on, Albedo. You do have the Nanashi buffs though. Uh, yeah, look at look at that, man. I still love Albedo so much. I know, I know, I know. The new melee can, like, quote-unquote, counter the Albedo. But look at this, man. Look at this. And with that being said, guys, I hope you still like this sort of content. If you do, consider liking, consider subscribing. And I will see you guys in the next one. And that's going to be tomorrow. So, bye-bye. And, of course, have an awesome rest of your day. <laughs>